you're playing through this game, or let's playing it, or trophy hunting, whatever you're doing with this game. Unless you're using it for toilet paper or something, then you're probably going to have to deal with this mission sooner or later. Which, that would be really painful to use a video game disc for toilet paper. Aw, oh, crap. That was close. Okay, what I want to do is... At first, Suns, I would normally like to vaporize you, but I don't really feel like doing so when I have all this stuff to do. Okay, so... I don't know why I just made that noise. Anyway, so here's our second balloon. It's probably gonna, like I said, if it starts taking too long, I'm probably just gonna edit it, but... For now, These guys are hard to uh, let's see. Yeah, we don't even have a clinic on this side of the map. I'm, I'm glad we're doing this. That's very good for us. Yeah, we don't even have one over here. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mr. Conduit, sir, what are you doing here? Wow. That was really, really easy. That was way too easy. Okay, you know what? You need to die too. Wow. That was really easy. <laughs> it's just like, oh, hello, Mr. Conduit. You are not allowed to be here. Dead. Thanks. I can save a lot of lives with these supplies. You about could have done that yourself, man. That was really easy. There were only like four of them. Including those fairly simple conduits. Now that is so weird for like the position of another level. I mean, we are nearing the end of the game though, so I would expect it to be a little more difficult, but still. Can you fly a little bit better though, John? I mean, seriously, that isn't really helping me that much. Oh man, he just got oh, dude. Seriously, you just got run over by a freaking train. How stupid are you? I killed him with a freaking exploding mine, too. Okay, so. Oh, just because. That might actually end up uh, being better for it, because it might refill its health a little bit. Because I'm kind of getting screwed over here, because he usually does not take that much damage. We've also got these annoying little grenade ear drones, and uh, it's dustmen everywhere instead of just basic reapers or dustmen. Dustmen or dustmen. Instead of just basic reapers or uh, dustmen instead of for sons. That was an RPG guy right behind me. Let's get rid of him. Oh, that's it. Right there. Okay, that was not totally fair, honestly. But that's good, though, because it refilled the helicopter's health anyway, so I'm really not going to complain about that. Okay, so what you got to do is find it. And it's actually going to be concealed. It's going to be invisible. So what you do is do like that. I took care of the jam. Good. Jeez, man, what is with all these enemies? Alright, I found the Okay, come on. How did it not save? I took out the stupid thing. So why did it not count? Like, seriously, what the heck? It should have counted. Okay. Since I am totally failing so far. Okay, really? This is starting to get really, really annoying. This mission is not this difficult. I don't know why this time I am getting swarmed by 10 times as many enemies as I am freaking used to. There's like 20 freaking RPG guys too, which is ridiculous. So many RPG guys and so many of those stupid little grenading drones. They're about the biggest issue is the little drones. I mean, I can usually handle the enemies, but... The drones, you can't tell where they're going. They can lob grenades literally right in your face at any point in time, and they turn invisible as well. There we go. 
All right, hold still. I gotta kill you. There we go. There we go. Let's kill both of you. Just chuck a grenade down there and see what happens. And there's another drone. Perfect. There we go. That should make this a little easier. Kill you. Oh, invisible guy. That's not good. So he was, I guess, a type of conduit as well. Body slam. Well, not even. Thunder drop. I see. Okay, I didn't even hit it. There we go. Okay, there we go. Now it's down. Good. Get back up here so we can look for the next one. Okay, let's see if on this one there can be slightly less failure. And John, why can't you just fly down a little bit further and make this a little easier on me? I mean, seriously, I'm the one doing all the work here. You're just flying a helicopter extremely slowly. Okay, let's do it. Probably don't know this, but I was chasing you the day of the blast. Trying to stop you from opening the package. If I had been a minute faster, I wouldn't even be here. So what happened? Awesome when you ran a red light. Amazing, isn't it? One red light. Look what happens. Yeah, that is pretty amazing. So that is this game teaching you lessons, kitties. Don't run red lights, because it might end up causing the end of the world. So, so yeah, don't run red lights, because it might result in the end of the world as you know it. Good lesson. Even though everyone I know runs red lights all the time, so yeah. Anyway, second shielded thingy. That's its official name, the second shielded thingy. Oh, that was pretty good. I killed him with the uh, guy's grenade thing, so cool. Good thing they were actually good for something for once, just like Cole McGrath. Okay, he's dead. Oh, hello, Conduit. I was not expecting to see you here. Oh, I killed him, okay. And we've got him. Hey, 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 hey. I'm supposed to be dead now. Oh, crap, that was accidental. Uh, I'm trying to remember exactly where the thing is. Okay, it's in this general area. Shooting out some electricity. Oh, wait, it's on the map, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Okay, it's in this area then. Oh, that's it. Yep, that's it. Uh, let's just do a few shock waves, try to get a little bit of safety, or just keep getting freaking light butt rate. Okay, I was just being kind of silent there because I was trying to concentrate, but we got him. Or the stupid conduit is good. Okay, seriously, that.